Morning everybody. Here we got uh, old Chris is getting the cows in today. Yeah, just us two walking away this morning. It'll be good. Oh, well, just wait for these last of these girls to start coming in. Get a full row, then we'll start bulking. <laughs> hey, you like your scratches, Joe Five? Good job. All right, let's get to bulking. Chris is going to learn to put the apron down properly. The relief bulk is going to throw off his block. Oh, crapped on it. <laughs> All right, so I. Uh, part of it, part and parcel. Oh, bulking's going well this morning. Nice and full. Ooh. And she's a good bulk in there. Yeah, old Chris goes. First day, close the gate. Come on, girl. She lasts. Oh, oh. It's the room. She knows. She doesn't want to run. <laughs> go, girls. Up we go. They run out the gate. That's why she doesn't want to run. Ooh. Go well. It was you die for Amazon. We're pumping. We are pumping. Oh, she needs a wait. Well, then old Chris off here doesn't know. She needs a wait. So the front left doesn't bulk out as well as the others. Gives her a helping hand. Hup, hup, hup. Right on, Chris. Like the apron. Do well, it. Not mine. Hup, hup. I like your apron. <laughs> <laughs> He's buggering around up here. He's mucking around up here. <laughs> I'm over in the fucking tip down, man. I, I don't know how you're going to work. Yeah, look at that. Not usually this time of year you got cows leaking milk. Cheapest. You should milk them on one day, though. You know, I'm all marked, Michael. That's what it looked like. I did let one go. Oh, wow. She was still going up nice the front. Bro, they just got the meal. This one doesn't eat meal. Just cupping her up. Doing all right? Only one way to do it. <laughs> all right. Let's finish this up. Oh, okay, right. Now well, Chris has really washed half the yard, or most of the yard already. I'm just going to wash this a little bit, and then we'll go down and lock some cows away. Hard to say whether the weather today, whether we'll be shipping the cows or not, we'll find out later. But uh, we're off to go lock cows away now and go set up a paddock for tonight, and that'll be us for this morning. Yeah, all the looking happy in here. I'm always happy with these cows. Six hundred litres today. It's not too bad. It should be going down by now, but it's going good. We're just washing the vat now. We've got a nice um, acid, hot acid about to go through. Harder up. So yeah, putting through a hot, just the acid wash today. Acid, and then two rinse, rinse before, rinse after. That's good. We're going well. The cows are pumping. So that means that we're sitting at about. About 390 odd solids at the moment, so. Girls are pumping. Right, old Chris has gone down to go get them. We'll just wait for them now. And we'll put through their final rinse. See all the girls coming now. Good girls, come on. Some ready heading up the rise. You see, they push it by themselves. Trying to find any meal that may be left over in the bins. They're happy. Right. 
Let's go start these machines and let's get it's to it. the first time today that the sun's actually popped out. It's been quite cloudy, overcast, like over there all day. But it's not actually rained at all, so. Oh, that's all right. It's part of it. Part and parcel is quite a nice day. Not too yeah, hot. Up we go. How we doing, Uncle Chris? Going all right? Alright, now you got a stone in your boot. <laughs> ah, that's all right. Cows coming, alright? Piece of cake. Piece of cake, that's all right. Yeah, girls are milking well again tonight. Dumping, dumping. Alright, take the head off. Just so this stops the cows from coming in more than anything else. Not, and backing out. Who doesn't like to back out? Hello, annoyance. That's annoyance 29. Go on, girls, up we go. War beast last. Why is she named War Beast? Because she was a heifer this year and she was one heck of a heifer to break in. But once she broke in, she's pretty ass. Hup, hup, hup. Go on, girls, up we go. Come on. Yard down, jeepers. Oh, Chris, close the gate. The little one here last. Let's see if you can get her. That's the one, yep, she's first. Come on, girls, up we go. Come on, ladies, up we go. Any more meal leaders out there? 250. You too. Two little heifers. Dad's washing the yard. How are we doing, Dad? Good, that's our way. Come on. Come on, you two. Get these two in last, and we'll go give them some meal. Come on. Come on. Hop. Push. Come on. Push, push. Yeah, not double pull today. <laughs> right. We'll get in our cap last here. Go on, girl, up you go. Come on. Friendly. Come on. Your dad's a bit quicker with the uh, unloading those there. Taking them off than uh, Uncle Chris, as you can see. Professional. <laughs> Their dad washed the arm, washed the pit. Oh, Chris, when he closed the gates, and I just finished washing up the cups. Oh, it's us. What do you say, old Chris? Walk a two time and subscribe. <laughs> like and subscribe. And I'll see you all in the morning. And uh, everyone have a amazing Christmas Eve. We'll see you all in the morning for milking Christmas Day. That's what Uncle Chris is trying to collect a Willy the Waiters. All on the underside of the uh, yeah, Waikato bottles because they usually they're all on top. It's underneath the specially marked ones. Cheers, cheers. Only look at the cow's eye. There's the neighbour's cows over there. Got the lush tucker. Awesome. Up. Uh, one thing I do have to show you: the cow troughs a bit low, but the trough is working. So it's going. Not much I can really do about it. Um, pumps on everything so they get the water as fast as it can go. This is the furthest paddock on the farm. I'm furthest down the first race, so see if the cows 